Hey everybody, welcome to a brand new series on the channel. Today, guys, we are starting our brand new Let's Play for Minecraft 1.14, the Village and Pillage update. I'm so excited. A lot of you were on the fence about me doing this, but guys, I have a great feeling about this series. It's going to be amazing, and I think you guys are really going to enjoy what I've got planned for you. So with that being said, we have a tentative schedule, which I'll get into more once we get into the video. But but if you are excited and you want to see more of this, guys, make sure you smash that like button. Show tons of support on this video, please. It would mean a lot to me. So without further ado, let's get into it. All right, guys. So to get started with today's video, I'm going to collect some wood in the background, get started while we talk about this series and what's going to happen and things like that that so first and foremost this let's play is going to last the entirety of minecraft 1.14 so what does that mean when 1.15 comes out we will start a new world now i know you're probably thinking jevin that's ridiculous why are you doing that well if you think about it minecraft 1.13 to 1.14 was about a year long so we have plenty of time to grind and make awesome episodes and content in this world. And I think from now on, we're probably going to follow that format because I just think that uh, it's better than having one Let's Play that lasts forever and the world gets so corrupted and laggy. And that's what was happening to my Let's Play world. Now you're probably wondering, well, okay, well, when are you gonna post this series? So that's a very good question. For those of you who follow the stream, you will know that my life in the next couple of weeks is going to be very hectic. I'm going to E3 this year and afterwards I'm going on vacation, meaning I'm going to be gone for 12 days in June. So a tentative upload schedule for the series on the channel will go as follows. This series, I, Jevin Plays Minecraft, will be on Sundays and Thursdays, three days in between each episode. Hermitcraft and Hermitcraft FTB will be on Tuesdays. That'll be a double upload day. Sky Factory 3 will be, or Sky, sorry, Sky Factory 4 will be on Monday, Wednesdays, and Fridays. And then that leaves Saturday open for any server series like the promo videos that I do. But that is our tentative schedule for the next two months. Um, so I hope you guys are excited for that. Now, this Let's Play, I am excited. This was a random seed that I generated, and I'm excited to play this because, like I said, I don't know a lot about 1.14, so I'm kind of hoping that there's, you know, a village around here, but first we got to get rid of this stone pickaxe. Now, um, the videos, I'm going to try my absolute best to make the best content for you guys as possible. You have given me tons of feedback over the last couple of episodes of different series that I have posted and i have put all of that feedback into this one so um i do ask that um you know you give this series a chance because i know a lot of you are like your diehard fans of keeping a series but you know the thing about youtube is that's weird is like all of the fans hate change but the creators have to make change in order to grow so all i ask is that you give it a chance now i think we should probably just do a little bit of exploring let me grab uh oh i don't want that <laughs> let me grab some cobblestone real fast so we can make a full set of tools and we're just going to look around and see what we can find all right because i really want to find one of those villages or one of those outposts i wouldn't mind trying to get a crossbow from one of those guys so with that being said uh and by the way you're probably wondering um are we ending any series or anything like that? The only series that's really going away is the old Let's Play, which I will put up for download when I find a suitable website for that kind of thing, because I'm not really sure where to host the file. The file's like three gigabytes. So with that being said, if you have any ideas um, of where I can do that, let me know. There we go. Also, let's make sure that we're on normal. <laughs> okay, so I think we'll just probably go forward here. Um, I don't want to spend too much time exploring because I do want to get into a cave and get a little bit of mining in, which I'll probably do off camera. But guys, I've actually got pretty big plans for this series. I have actually been thinking about um, this Let's Play for about two months now and just thinking about what I might want to put into this Let's Play. So... I've got big I've got big plans. What are our cords here? So we are going in the negative direction. Let's maybe 
Let's, eh. I see Taiga over there. Let's go, because I want to stay in the Taiga this time. Um, if I see anything as close as an Acacia Biome or a Savannah, I'm running. I am staying completely away. So it looks like we've got a Flower Forest over there. Oh, that's awesome. I like that. We got horses right there. Actually, let's go ahead and kill these sheep real fast. That way we can get ourselves a bed. That'll be good. All right. There we go. Going to kill you guys. That's good that they're all there. Wow, we actually have quite a few biomes around us. So I'm playing on render distance of 16. And so far, I don't really see a lot of lag. But so we've got um, we had forest where we spawned. We've got extreme hills with taiga, and then we have a roofed forest. Plus, we have flower forests, and we got llamas. Man, we're out here. We're winning, guys. We're winning. So I will say this, right? I really want to play in a snow biome. Now, I know that doesn't make for good YouTube content because of the video quality. It can kind of get grainy, but I hope we really find one. That would be amazing. And oh, those the llamas kind of freak me out. I'm not gonna lie to you, they're a little creepy. So let's just see what's over this hill. If there's anything worthwhile, we'll check it out. I'm probably just gonna keep running for a while to see what we can find, grab some food, stuff like that. So it looks like we've got more extreme hills moving forward. What are our cords now? So we're just we're just kind of doing the negative thing here. All right, whoa, that's a lot of pigs. Holy crap! All right, so I'm gonna start killing animals and getting food together, and I'll be back. Okay, guys, I've been exploring. Guess what I actually found? Not only did we find a, a, a plains with those blue new flowers, but I found a snow biome. Oh my goodness, I'm excited. I really, really hope that there's a village over here because that would just make things perfect. I love snow biomes and I feel like they don't get enough love. So we'll see what happens here. But um, this is the first I've seen. Oh, there's a village over there. Oh, that's exciting. Oh yes, all right, let's go there. Because I'm going there. I want to see all the new little items. I don't know. We may. Oh, there's a polar bear. <laughs> my my uh, attention span is about five seconds right now, but it's okay. It's okay. Right, I wonder if, um, I wonder if the igloos still spawn. Like, I wonder if that's an actual thing. Huh. I saw we have pumpkins back there too. Okay. I am excited. Okay, so we, we have got to the village here. Oh, there's a kitty cat. Hi, Mr. Kitty. Oh, let me love you. I just want to love you. You're my bestie. So this was one of the pre-made blocks that we... This is more of like a, a target block. Decoration. Fletcher. You know how he does. So, oh, I want to get in there. Let me grab some cobble and bridge over. Look at me doing the villagers a solid. I'm such a nice guy. Anything in here? So let's take the coal. Add a little bit of that to our collection. Add the furnace and a little bit of bread. Some snow blocks and a cool looking bed. All right. Oh man, I love the lanterns. They're so good. All right, I'm gonna definitely, definitely grab that. That's the composter. Okay, guy, what's your trade farmer? So he's got, okay, okay. I'm feeling it, I'm feeling it. There's an iron golem over there. Hi, Mr. Iron Golem. Ooh, who is he? Come here, friend. Let me let me be your friend. You are a mason. And oh, kitties. Can I not? Uh, oh, does he not have a? He doesn't have any. I guess they have to have like a gem on their pocket. Okay. I watched Ethos video just like all of you. <laughs> I'm just saying, okay. Um, grab that. Don't want. Uh, you know what? I'll grab a potato. We should also grab some other food while we're here. Um. Those are potatoes. I don't want the potatoes. Put that back. There we go. What's your trade, sir? Okay, so he's got the same kind of farmer novice trades. All right. Well, there's a few things I haven't seen yet. I want to try to find the grindstone and some of the other little machines. 
fell. <laughs> That's so cool. <laughs> I'm so excited. What's in here? You are not a guy. Anything in there? Okay. What is up here? So we still have a few village buildings we haven't looked at. It's cool that there's blue ice here. That's so exciting. Ooh, hello. I'll be taking you today. Thank you, good sir. What are we? We are a stone cutter. Anything in any of those? No. Look at all the little kitties. They're so cute. I love cats, by the way. If you haven't noticed already, I'm a huge cat fan. <laughs> okay. Uh, nothing in there. And let's check this igloo here. Sorry to interrupt, people. Okay. Let's see what this guy's got trade. So I don't want to stay at this village very long. Not that I don't want to live here because that would be amazing, but I don't want the villagers to die. And if I'm not in the area, they won't die. Uh, still more potatoes. I don't know if carrots can grow in this, maybe? There's a bunch of those, so grab those. Grab those. Before I leave here, I will try to find a carrot, though. I just wanted to finish exploring. Is there anything else here that I missed? I think we got everything. So we didn't look in the big building over there, which is fine. Um, what is, is, oh, I think that's actually either another vill, is that another village? What is that right there, guys? Hold on. I got to see what this is. It's going to bug me if I don't look. Um, that might be an igloo or another village. I think it's an igloo. I don't know. What if it was one of those fancy igloos, like the one that has the villager trapped in the bottom? Hey, Mr. Bunny Rabbits, how you doing today? Guys, I'm so pumped for this. The inspiration juice is flowing. Let's just say that. Okay. Uh, it might actually be the fancy one. Uh, in here. Oh, I thought it would be. Oh, no, it is. Oh, my God, that's insane. The craziest amount of luck right now, guys. Oh, my God, there is no way this is here right now. Okay. Mr. Villager, I'm coming to save you. So there's our zombie villager. There's our regular villager. Tiny little cactus, so cute, look at it. And then we got a splash potion of weakness and our golden apple. Guys, should we go ahead and convert our man here? I think we should. All right, so to convert said villager, we need to give him the, Do we? I think we do the splash potion first, then we give him the apple, so you. You. <laughs> okay, now that is the loudest sound of all time. So I'm going to turn the hostile creature sounds down. And over here, what do we got in here? He's a nobody. He doesn't have any tr any trades at all. Okay. Interesting. Well, I'm going to wait for this guy to change over, and I'm also going to steal all this loot. All right, guys. So our villager has converted over. Unfortunately, neither of them have trades. Now, I'm not sure if there is a way to switch them over in the new update, but we're going to have to look into that. Hopefully, that's a possible thing. We are going to use this little outpost, this igloo, as a base. So, I've already been mining some and got some goodies for you guys. Now, some very exciting stuff to show you. Very exciting. Let's go downstairs, shall we? So, as you can imagine... My diamond finding ability has not left because I have found diamonds. I have found quite a few diamonds, actually. So typically what I'll do is I'll mine three high and just go straight. Then I'll do a block, two blocks, two blocks, just like so. Uh, but what, I'm, what I'll typically do is, is I'll just poke in a few uh, as I go down the lane, trying to, you know, if, if I see something, I'll mine that way. But... Uh, there are a few pathways here that we need to go down. This one is the first one. We have one diamond right here. That texture is weird looking. I don't like it. <laughs> so it doesn't look like there's any more here. It's like, so one, one diamond so far. We need at least 12 for a full set of tools. So that's what we're going for. Uh, ultimately, I would like to have iron or diamond armor too. So we'll see what happens. Nothing down that one. Nothing down that one. That one has gold. Let's grab that. I forgot that this was here. And I'm I'm almost certain that there is a cave somewhere around here. If you listen, the hostile creatures on 100%. 
Oh, yeah, he's got to be right above us. Uh, he's there somewhere. We'll find him. We'll find him. It ain't a big deal. Oh, yeah, he's like he's like right there somewhere. Anyways, not important. So music and sound. Turn that back down to 20. So let's keep going. There's more. There's four, at least four here. Grab this. So, oh, yeah, there's definitely a cave there. Oh, good diamonds. Good diamonds. Sad I don't have fortune, but uh, there's nine. So we need at least three more. I don't know if I found three more or not. It wasn't I think there was one more row. Oh, right there. Okay. So here. Oh, yes. We have enough to make a full set of diamond tools, baby. Oh, yeah. I'm going to take a screenshot of that because it's beautiful. There we go. <laughs> okay. I love diamonds. They're so fun. We got 17 diamonds total and any over here. Now I kind of want to try to poke ahead in that, that tunnel. It's, it's, it's definitely above us. I want to say like right there, let me make another pickaxe real fast. There we go. There we go. I want to say, Let's turn this back up real fast. Sound 100%. Yeah, it's like it's like right here. Oh, I found lapis. <laughs> okay. That works. Now We got to be careful cuz we don't have any armor. So we got to like really play this cool here, people. We don't want to die. Oh, we are so close. It sounds like he's still above us. Ah, oh, it's a mine shaft. I see. Well, that's cool that we found a mine a mine shaft right above us. That's amazing. Cool. All right, now let's um let's go back over here. And you you I have a way with diamonds, guys. I can't help it. I am a diamond whisperer. There we go. Full set of diamond tools with eight diamonds left to spare, plus enough iron to make a full set of iron armor. I've got more iron upstairs. There we go. Put some more on. So we got some more armor on ourselves now as well. Fantastic. Okay, so now that we have established ourselves, Let's go ahead and make a little bit of storage and just kind of get a tiny little base going that way. Once we decide where we actually want to build, we'll know exactly what to do. So we're going to remove all this real fast so we can actually open our chests. Ah, so, okay. Silverfish. Anyways, so come over here. I've got that smelting. Let's make that into stone brick. And we need to put the stone brick into the stone cutter to make that. We need uh, at least three of those. I like that. That's uh, okay. So I'm not going to lie. <laughs> I was a little, I don't know. I was a little, I don't know if I was uninterested or just, I wasn't really sure how to take the machine part of the game. But after seeing that, I kind of like it. Like, I think that's pretty cool. So I don't have a crafting table up here. I left it downstairs. Let me go ahead and make that. Make some chests. So we'll need two, four, six. Actually, let's turn all of those into it. And since we can pile chests on next to each other, we should be good to go. Place those there. Okay, so I'm... Oh, what? <laughs> That's weird. I'm not used to that. <laughs> not used to that at all oh my goodness that's strange you guys notice that oh my god okay so i have to get a little bit more wood later on because we don't have a full thing of wood here but go here and then get rid of that and oh that's that's so strange not used to it we'll just do a little fake wall there for now a little bit of houdini act and never hurt anybody there we go and I'll get all these chests organized off camera and just get everything in there for now. There we go. Make sure we got everything picked up. Awesome. Okay, so now that that's done, 
Okay, we're gonna, I feel like we're probably gonna use this a lot. So let's grab that and let's grab this and break into this. Oh, another, is it on peaceful? It is on peaceful. There we go. Awesome. I was wondering why that happened. I didn't notice that. I did save and quit, so. I have always had that problem in Minecraft. I don't understand what the issue is. Um, so grab some furnaces and we'll probably put them in the back here just like that and then i think what i'll probably do to keep things pretty simple go there and then there just like that for now that'll work really well okay put some stone brick in the ground and fantastic we have ourselves just a little kind of hideout i like it a lot actually so guys i think that's probably going to do it for this first episode of our 1.14 Minecraft Let's Play. So if you're excited, make sure you please hit the like button. Let's go for a thousand likes, guys. This is iJevin. Peace out, everybody.